Hello guys, today I'm going to be doing a video on the iPhone 5S fingerprint sensor. So, what you're going to want to do to actually use the fingerprint sensor is go into the settings, go down into general, go down into the touch I oh my bad, go down into the touch ID and by here you're going to want to set your um you're going to want to put in your passcode. And uh, once you put in your passcode, you're going to want to go to Touch ID. And by here, you could do whatever you want. You could uh, go here, edit, delete, whatever you want to do. Um, and up here, the settings, you can, uh, if that focuses, you could put in the iPhone unlock, which is pretty much just unlocks your iPhone. And then the other one, to go back into the settings... The other one is for the iTunes and App Store, so when you buy something in the iTunes or App Store, you could just use your fingerprint, easy as that, and it will buy or download whatever you want it to do. So what you're going to want to do to actually use this is go ahead and go into Add Fingerprint. Once you're at Add Fingerprint, it's going to say that you have to place your finger on the um, home button, and what you're going to have to do is keep on doing that, and when it vibrates, take your finger off the home button and that's pretty much all you do for the setup so it's basically easy and it just takes a while to read your finger so this might take uh, I would say not more than a minute and 30 seconds or even a minute really it doesn't take that long but if it's your first time it might take a little longer so I have already uh, used this fingerprint but um, once you do that you could go ahead and add it. You could even put names into the fingerprint. So whatever you want to do. And uh, once it's in the fingerprints right here, uh, you could use it for your unlocking or you could use it for the iTunes and App Store. So that's basically what you could do with this. It unlocks it pretty easily. Um, I haven't had... My bad, my camera has died. But all I was saying is that it usually doesn't ever have trouble with unlocking or anything like that but if you do have trouble with it go ahead and leave a comment down below and maybe I will be able to help you but that's been it for this video don't forget to leave a comment like this video and subscribe for more videos alright guys see you in my next one